Something about 3i Atlas changed today. Not in theory, not in simulations, in real images from independent observers taken hours apart. The color is shifting. The structure isn't behaving the same way. And the features we expected to fade are getting clearer instead. This isn't noise. And it's not just one data set. Let's look at what's actually changing. First, the color. Earlier images were dominated by a smooth, uniform green glow. Today, that balance is off. The inner region is showing a warmer yellow-gold core while the surrounding green emission is shifting outward instead of staying centered. That's not a cosmetic change. It points to a real shift in what's dominating the emission. Now the core itself. If this object were settling down or breaking apart, we'd expect the center to soften and spread. Instead, it's doing the opposite. The core is more compact, the brightness falls off faster, and the boundary between the nucleus region and the surrounding envelope is sharper than before. That's a sign of continued activity, not decay. Next, the tail structure. In earlier frames, the tail looked broader and slightly diffuse. In the newest images, it's cleaner, more directional, more stable from frame to frame. In star-suppressed versions, a blue-leaning anti-solar component becomes easier to isolate. That tells us the outflow isn't random, it's organized. And here's what we're not seeing. No secondary cores, no debris cloud, no sudden loss of brightness. There's no clear evidence of fragmentation. What we're seeing looks like a transition, not a breakup. The important part is the timing. These changes didn't take weeks. They appeared between closely spaced observations. Color balance, core contrast, tail coherence. Something about how 3i Atlas is interacting with sunlight has shifted, recently. So the question now isn't whether something changed, it's why. And that's where the discussion really begins. Now look at this frame. This isn't a natural color image. It's a heavily processed, star-suppressed view designed to isolate structure. And what it reveals is important. At the center, the core shows up as a compact, high-contrast region, surrounded by a distinctly asymmetric halo. The red-toned envelope isn't evenly distributed. It's offset. That tells us the emission isn't expanding uniformly in all directions. Something is shaping it. More importantly, the tail is no longer just a diffuse smear. There's a narrow, linear feature extending cleanly away from the core. Thin, directed, persistent. That's not what random dust dispersion looks like at this distance. This kind of structure usually points to one of two things. Either a localized active region on the surface, or a shift in how sunlight is interacting with material being released. Both scenarios require ongoing activity, not something winding down. If this object were fragmenting, we'd expect chaos in frames like this. Blurring, multiple peaks, loss of coherence. Instead, what we see is organization. This image doesn't show collapse. It shows direction. And when you line this up with the color shift and the tightening core we saw earlier, a pattern starts to emerge. So the question now isn't just what we're seeing, it's whether this behavior is temporary or the beginning of a new phase in how 3i Atlas is evolving. And the next set of observations will tell us a lot more. Now focus on this frame. This is a star-lined grayscale capture, and that matters because it strips away color bias and processing tricks. What's left is structure. Look at the central condensation. It's not fuzzy. It's not smeared. There's a tight, almost point-like core sitting inside a darker inner halo. That's a strong brightness gradient. If this object were simply dispersing, we'd expect the center to soften first. Instead, the core stays compact while the surrounding coma fades outward. That tells us the activity is still being driven from a localized source. Now look at the symmetry. The coma isn't evenly round. 
there's a subtle elongation aligned with the measured position angle, the same direction seen in today's other datasets. Different processing, same geometry. That's not random. Also note the background. Stars are clean, no trailing artifacts, no distortion that could fake a directional feature. So what you're seeing here isn't motion blur or stacking error, it's intrinsic to the object. This frame reinforces the same pattern, a stable, compact core with directional structure emerging rather than dissolving. And that's important because this is exactly the stage where many objects start losing coherence. 3i Atlas isn't. What we know so far is this. Across today's images, 3i Atlas is not fading the way we expected. The color has shifted. Recent frames show a move toward a greener, slightly yellowish glow compared to earlier images. The central region remains compact, the core stays tight and concentrated instead of spreading outward. Internal structure is becoming clearer. Features that should be softening are sharpening instead. There is also a stable directional extension. It stays aligned across multiple images taken hours apart. The surrounding glow is not uniform. It shows clear asymmetry, suggesting uneven activity rather than random noise. Most importantly, there is no sign of breakup, no fragments, no secondary objects. The structure remains coherent. These changes aren't coming from one observer or one setup. They're showing up independently across different locations using different equipment. So what we're seeing is not weakening, it's definition. And that's where today's update leaves us, with an object that's becoming clearer not quieter. So now it comes down to this. Today's new images, especially the latest captures from Dan Bartlett, don't show chaos. They don't show breakup. They show change, a shift in color, a shift in texture, and a subtle shift in how this object is expressing activity. What do you think is happening here? Is this a natural transition in what's being released? A surface change we're finally resolving? or something we haven't fully seen yet? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. I read every one. And if you want to keep following 3i Atlas as new images land, subscribe. Share this with someone watching this story, and stay curious.